Hello, everyone. Welcome to the training sessions. Passwords Octopus in three minutes. In this tutorial, we'll walk you through how to deal with inputting keywords. Let's start with searching keywords. For example, let's say we need to scrape lightning cable products from eBay. Before we get to a product listing page, we may need to search the keyword lightning cable on the eBay and then click search to get the list of products. So we need to input the keywords and then click search. Let's see how we should make octopus to do it. As we need to input the keywords to on this search bar, so we can click on it and then we have the option enter text and here we can enter the lightning cable and confirm it then you can see there's an option of enter text created in the workflow and then we need to click this search button so we select it and choose click button and there will be a click item created in the workflow. And here we get to the product listing page. <clears throat> and it is easy to scrape data and create pagination from here. In case we need to um, search a list of keywords on this web page, we can create a loop in this workflow and then. Select the mode as text list. Enter the keywords here, like lightning cable. Oops. Okay, make sure you have one search term on one line, and then we confirm it. Click apply to save, and then we drag this enter text inside the loop item. And we click this and go back to the enter text. Then you have the option of use text in the loop to enter the text box. We tick this and click apply. Okay. And this is for, for this enter text to use the text we have input in this loop item. And then we drag this click item inside it too. So this will input the list of text we have entered here one by one on this web page and if you wanted to uh, know which keyword the the products are from you can select select a search bar again and then choose extra text box value okay this is for extracting the input keywords as an as a field 